Assalamu alaikum my dear students, how are you? I hope you are all well by the grace of Almighty. Welcome to NIE Bay Sobe School. I am Ashish Vishash, an assistant teacher of mathematics in National Ideal English Version School Morning Shift. Today I am going to take a math class for the student of class 5. So my dear student, let us start our class. Dear student, today is our lecture number 26 of half yearly and today's SW number 16. Dear student, our today's topic is exercise 6a okay from the chapter we shall solve question number 3 okay from 3 we shall solve 1 7 11 and 14 number question as your cw and from the same question that means from question number 3 we shall solve question number 4 8 and 15 as your sw so my dear student open your math book page number 44 page number 44 from, from that page we shall solve Question number 3. From 3, we shall solve question number 1, 7, 1, 7, 11 and 14. I have written the question on the board. So, please notice the board. Here you notice, calculate 1, 4 by 6 plus 3 by 6, 7, 4 by 15 plus 1 into 1 by 12, 11, 3 minus 3 by 4, 12, 2 into 2 by 3 minus 4 by 5. So, at first we solve question number one four by six plus three by six dear student as at first we do addition of these two fraction okay so what is the procedure of so addition of two fraction first of all we takes the we take the denominator of the fraction here denominator of the fractions are six and six now we find out the LCM of this two denominator. Notice here 6 and 6 both divided by the prime number 2. 2 3 is a 6 and 2 3 is a 6. Here you notice 3 and 3. This 3 and 3 both are divided by the prime number 3. 3 1 is a 3, 3 1 is a 3. Now we multiply these two number 2 3 is a 6. So 6 is the LCM. So our first work is uh, we need to find out LCM of the denominators here the denominators of 6 and 6 is 6 sorry 6 LCM of denominator 6 and 6 is 6 so this denominator is written here now this time we divide this denominator that means LCM by the denominator of the first fraction that means if we divide 6 by this 6 then we get 1 okay that one is multiplied with the that 4 so 4 multiply 1 plus again we divide this lcm by the denominator of the second fraction here denominator of the second fraction is 6 lcm is 6 so if we divide 6 by 6 then we get 1 so that one is multiplied with the numerator here numerator is 1 so 4 on is 4 plus 3 1 is 3 divided by 6 4 plus 3 it will be 7 by 6 now we not uh, now we get 7 by 6 which is a which is an improper fraction we want to convert this improper fraction into mixed fraction here 7 in 7 6 goes in on times 6 on the 6 and subtract we get 1 so 1 into 1 by 6 this is the answer okay right I hope you have understood how to do addition. Okay, just like this one, we shall solve question number 7. Okay. Three question number 7. First of all, we write the question here. 415 plus 1 into 1 by 12. Dear student, at notice. 415 is a proper fraction on the other hand 1 by 1 into 1 by 12 is a mixed fraction so when we want to do addition then first of all we uh, convert the improper fraction into uh, sorry the convert the mixed fraction into improper fraction okay so first of all we write 4 by 15 then we convert this mixed fraction into improper fraction we know 
denominator will be same then we multiply this integer by the denominator so 12 on this 12 and then adding numerator with the multiplication so 12 on the 12 plus 1 13 so we write 13 okay now notice 4 by 15 plus 13 by 12 okay so now we take the denominator of the two fractions here denominator of the two fractions are 15 and 12 so here write 15 and 12 now we find out lcm of the two denominators here notice both number is divided by the prime number 3 so if we divide 15 by 3 then we get 5 if we divide 4 uh, 12 by 3 then we get 4 now notice lcm equal to 3 multiply 5 multiply 4 okay 3 5 jar 15 15 4 jar 60 so 60 is the lcm so we write 60 as denominator that means this lcm is written as denominator now notice we divide this lcm by the denominator of the first fraction that means here denominator of the first fraction is 15 so if we divide 60 by 50 then we get 4 and that 4 is multiplied with this 4 so 4 multiplied by 4 this plus sign is here after that we divide this 60 by the denominator of the second fraction here denominator of the second fraction is 12 so if we divide 60 by this 12 then we get 5 so that 5 is multiplied with this 13 so multiply by 13 sorry at first we write 13 then we write 5 now we do multiplication 4 4 jar 16 plus 13 5 jar 65 divided by 60 now we do addition 5 6 1 carrying uh, 5 6 11 from that 11 we write here 1 carrying on 6 on 7 plus 1 8 okay divided by 60 dear student notice 81 and 60 both number are cut by the number 3 so if we cut 81 by 3 then we get 3 2 are 6 and 21 3 7 are 21 again we cut this 60 by 3 and we get 20 so we get 27 by 20 now we divide this 27 by 20 in 27 20 goes in one times 21 the 20 now we subtract we get 7 so the mixed fraction will be 1 into 7 by 20 this is the answer of this question i hope you have understood okay next we shall solve question number 11 okay please note this question number 11 first of all we write the question so here you notice 3 minus 3 by 4 so dear student we know that every number has a denominator which is 1 so we written this uh, number as fraction 3 by 1 okay minus 3 by 4 okay now we find out the lcm of 1 and 4 the lcm of 1 and 4 is 4 so now we divide this 4 by 1 and we get 4 and that 4 is multiplied with this 3 so 3 multiplied by 4 this minus sign is here after that we divide this lcm by the denominator of the second fraction that means 4 we divide 4 by 4 and we get 1 that one is multiplied with 3 3 ones are 3 now 3 4 jar 12 3 ones are 3 divided by 4 so we subtract if we subtract 3 from 12 then we get 9 9 by 4 so we divide this 9 by 4 in 9 4 goes in 2 times then we get 8 Sub, uh, and subtract we get 1 so the mixed fraction is 2 into 1 by 4 this is the answer of question number 11 i hope you have understood okay how to do subtraction of two fractions okay next we shall solve our last questions today's question which is question number 14 
सो क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टीन इज टू इंटू टू बाई थ्री डिप माइनस फोर बाई फाइव सो प्लीज टू थ्री जार सिक्स सिक्स प्लस टू एट बाई थ्री माइनस फोर बाई फाइव टू थ्री जार सिक्स प्लस टू एट डिवाइडेड बाई थ्री माइनस फोर बाई फाइव Now we find out the LCM of these two denominators. Here denominators are three and five. Dear student, please notice when there is no common prime factor between two number, then the LCM of the two numbers will be their product. Will be their product. Here you notice three and five. Okay, there is no. Common prime factor between this three and five, so their LCM will be their multiplication. That means three five zero fifteen will be their LCM. So this fifteen is written here. Now we divide this fifteen by three. If we divide fifteen by three, then we get five. Five is multiplied with this eight. So eight multiplied by five minus sign is here. After that we divide this fifteen by this five and we get. Three. Okay, so fifteen by divided by five, we get three. Three is multiplied with this four. So four multiplied by three. So eight five jar forty minus three four jar twelve minus fifteen. Okay, now we do uh, uh, subtraction eight to ten. Two to ten, it will be eight. Carrying on, that one is added with this one. It is two. Two to four, it is two. So fifteen. So now we divide this twenty-eight by fifteen. Fifteen on the fifteen, fifteen to the thirteen. If we take two times, then it is more than twenty-eight. So we take one time. So fifteen on the fifteen. Now we subtract and we get. If we subtract five from eight, then we get three. If we subtract one from two, then we get one. So the mixed fraction is one into thirteen by fifteen. This is the answer of this question. I hope you have unders uh, understood, and this is the answer of this question. Okay. So my dear student, this is our today's topics. I hope you have understood my today's lecture. How to calculate? Okay, question number three. By the same way, you shall. Uh, solve some problem as your is w which is in exercise 6a and page 44 the question from question number 3 we shall solve 4 8 and 15 number question i repeat 4 8 and 15 number question you must do your assign is w in your is w copy and submit it regularly in our school campus in every saturday within 9 am to 3 pm so my dear student keep practicing at home avoid by your parents see you soon till then assalamu alaikum